Hi, I'm BJ Levy. I've been a coach since 2000. I got into coaching after being a lawyer for 27 years and coming to the place where I can't do this anymore. So I do know what it's like to be in a place of uh, great stress, having stress in your life, and also what it can mean to make some changes. When I left the law, I was really looking for what I wanted to do next and looked at what was important for me to do, what was important to have in my next career, and what was important for there not to be in the next career. And I actually used that as a piece of coaching. I think it really helps. And taking small steps. So what's the next step I can take that naturally leads to the next step? I don't have to have all the answers. One of the clients I worked with was an owner of a company of about 50 or 60 people. And he came to me because he was working about 18 hour days and had no private life. And we realized together that what was going on for him is that he did not did not trust his employees to do as good a job as he would do. And when we worked together where he could start seeing them as whole and capable and resourceful, he could start letting go and um, letting them do more of the work. And as he did that, he found that not only did the work get done as good as he could do it, but sometimes better, just different. And he started creating his own private life. So he got married, he started traveling, and his bottom line actually increased. The reason that Invite Change is such an important piece of this is that we really try to walk our talk. In our meetings, we support each other, um, we're direct with each other, we see each other as whole people who also need private lives as well as our working lives, and we really look at where do we fit in the best? What's ours to do and what's ours not to do? And that's what we also bring to our clients, uh, to our private clients, to our corporate clients, is to really look at what's your place? What do you do best? And how do you bring that out?